Hello friends, in this video tutorial, let us see the data mining algorithm of association rules mining with the help of SSAS. So for the purpose of this video tutorial, let us go to SSDT, let us create a new project. So let's, let's name the project as SSAS data mining phi, right? Let's select the first template which is for data mining that is multi-dimensional and data mining project. Click OK. Okay, let's add a new data source to our adventure works DW database. Okay. So let me go to the database. So let us select adventure works DW database. Let us connect with service account, finish. Let us add DSV. We will use two views over here, which are having interconnected data, linked data related to sales. Okay, one is the order item and second is order details, that is line item, level view. So click next, let's call it as DSV finish now views will not have foreign keys between them right so we'll have to create a relationship between them in our logical structure right so let us relate this to basically okay, this is orders and this is line item so let us relate this to let's save this and let's go to mining structures, add a new mining structure from existing data or tables or views, right? So let's go and add Microsoft Association Rules mining structure. Next, now orders is our base table, that is the case table, right? And line items is a detail table related to this main input table. So it's a nested table. Next. So now customer key is not the main primary key. So order number is the key, right? So order number is the key and we want model from the detail table, right? Also, we want to predict the model, right, using this. So this will be our selection. Next. We don't want to keep 30% for testing, right? So we want to study uh, the whole data. So let's click next. Let's call it as mining structure. Let's call this as association rules. Okay, finish. So now our association rules have been created. So let us go and deploy them. But before deploying them, let's go to our database. Right, we can see that currently there is no database called SSS data mining file, right? Whereas so go to properties, deployment, the name of the database is SSS data mining phi, right? So let us provide the name of this database for deployment, okay. Now let's deploy everything. So if we go to our database now, so the new database has been created, right? And new mining structure is there, association rules, right? So now let's go to the mining model viewer. Right? So 
what it is telling us. is see whenever road 250 and road tire tube are bought then hl road tire is also bought okay why because the probability is one that is 100 percent and importance is more than one right a value of more than one for importance suggests that there is positive correlation okay and a value of less than one suggests that there is negative correlation right so over here there is very strong correlation and the probability of this purchase is 100 percent right so in this way you can find out which are the associated associated items that are being bought together right what is the pattern in the purchasing behavior also if you go to item set we can get interesting things like so let's go and make it two right so this gives you which are the items which are being purchased together right so uh, mountain bottle cage and water bottle have been purchased for the maximum time that is 1623 times okay so this has got the highest support that is the highest number of times when these two items have been purchased together right so in this also you can find out association between the items being bought together if you want to find out association for three items then we just make it three over here and we can see that mountain bottle cage mountain 200 and water bottle are being bought together for the maximum of time right when we are talking about three items right so in this way also we can find out association between multiple items right also if you go to dependency network it, it gives you very good diagram right you know which are the items that are being bought together correct okay correct so if you want to know which are the items that are actually after buying this item the customer tends to buy mountain tire tube right so after buying hl mountain tire the customer is a having tendency of buying mountain tire tube okay so in this way you have to interpret this diagram and these clusters or let's say these diagrams actually show us the which are the items being bought together okay so touring after touring tire touring tire tube is being bought by the customer okay so in this way also you can find out the associations now if you want you can also go to mining prediction and over here also you can find out okay once the things have been deployed okay so what you can say over here is let's say you want to find out that after water bottle right what is being bought okay along with the water bottle what what is the thing that is being bought okay so what we will do is we will go over here we say prediction function right and let's say which are the four items that are being bought along with water bottle right so that's why i have put a four over here right so now if you go to results okay then it tells you that along with water bottle sport 100 and all these three, three other items are being bought together that is these four are the items which are generally found along with the water bottle okay for the customer purchases so I hope friends this video tutorial is useful to you, thank you.